Hello friends! My today's story is about my television internship in Moscow. If you watched my previous vlog on places to visit in Moscow, then you know a little bit about myself. But now I want to tell you a little more. My first bachelor degree was in fashion marketing and management. But after a couple of years, I decided to change it to TV directing. In reason, because of how much I love editing videos and much more. So studying fall 2017, I'm moving to New York City and I'm going to NYIT, majoring in digital film and television production. And recently, I had my first television internship in my home city, Moscow. Entire time I followed two TV directors, Konstantin Kutz and Alexander Pakrishkin. Majority of shows I watched and learned from were directed by Konstantin Kutz. First show you see is Moment of Glory. This show is same as British Got Talent. Same rules and same results. And next is Daily Political Talk Show. This show I was able to see few times. Another show is Film in Russian Army Theater. That has a shape of a star, by the way. This is my all-time favorite entertaining young comic show, KVN. We have it over 56 years. On this show, I learned how well TV director reacts on players and how fast he sees all cameras and switch between them. As well as I was able to see and meet Elgar Zapashnik, famous circus dynasty Zapashnik in the fourth generation. He trains tigers as well as he's the head of the team Moscow Circus. Meeting Point is another political show. That one is live every day. This was the largest apparent room I've been in. On screens, you can see other channels, commercials at real time, and windows for graphic design, and much more. Many people, but each person knows exactly what they're doing. Many talk shows, political and some comic shows, shoot in main place in Moscow called Astankina. It is over 50 years old. Mosfilm is a place where majority Russian movies are filmed. They have over 10 places to film, as well as a large fake city where you can create 19th century street or make it 2017. And if you want to learn history of this place and movies, you can visit the museum inside of it. I saw beautiful posters on how many famous movies were made and how entire team makes the forest inside of the studio. <laughs> what I was really amazed to see is amazing dresses and cameras used for movies. Each dress has amazing details, makes it look like it's real vintage dress. Each camera in years it was used is amazing. Electronics improved so much since then. I really like this fragment from old movie V. If you ever read book by Gogol, you know this part. There have been many famous and many versions of this book, but I think this one is the best one. Those are the best cameras I have ever seen. Never been so close to such a beautiful and what we call nowadays vintage cameras. Same location I watched how natural selection show was shoot. This show is about how people trying product they like 
without knowing what brand it is. And at the end, people can see brand. As well as each product passing throughout few tests and at the end of the show, you can see what benefits you can get from the product or even if it's healthy or not for you. At first, when you look at these cameras, you think you will never understand where is what. But actually, after first show, I understand that it's so much simpler than it looks. One main camera, one preview, about 10 cameras you switch between, and maybe a few special graphics design. Not too hard. When I had the chance to walk around, I love to follow extremely long wires and cables. Sometimes you think there's a no end to this. You Are Super is an entertaining show similar to Voice, except it's only for children from orthodoxes. This show gives great opportunity not for just talented children, but also gives them a new families. This season was the first season and few kids got their new families. I was able to see how people work behind the scenes. First show I saw was semi-finals. So I woke up at 5 in the morning because shoot was outside of Moscow, only by 8.30 I got there. From 9 in the morning to 5 p.m. there was a rehearsal. From 5 p.m. to 12 at night, yes, to 12 at night, shoot was over and only by 1 in the morning I got back home. So I was awake for over 20 hours and many people worked like that for a few days in a row. In finals of the show, I saw in Kremel. Okay, let's get into a little entertainment. If you visit Moscow, go and watch amazing clowns show. Great for entire family. I wanted to visit this show since I was little and it took amazing pictures with Paloin who organized this show many years ago. Okay, let's get back to television now. I told you about Balshoi Theatre before in my last vlog, but this time I visited with TV crew. This time I saw amazing rooms and scene. As well mentioned before, this theatre was built in 1856 and you can watch opera and ballet. Since I was here with TV crew, they shoot video for Culture Channel that tells a history about many events and places. The part I was able to watch and what you see now is a rehearsal of a new show that coming up soon and I listen to beautiful opera singers. When we still had Tsar, his family has a special seat right in the center to watch beautiful ballet and opera. So our tour for today is over. But to sign up for more, all you need to do is click subscription button under this video. Thank you so much my friends and I'll see you in my next video.